Good morning children and hello parents. Welcome to standard 3 moral science class. Children, I've got a few things in my hand. Here I have a few pens, I have a diary and I have a writing book. Now tell me who makes use of all these items. These things are used by a student. Here I have a trophy and a medal and these things are awarded to an ideal student. So we are going to do be an ideal student. Today we will do Living Values Book 3, Chapter 6, Be an Ideal Student. I will read the lesson and you are going to listen to it attentively. Chapter 6, be an ideal student. All of us should try to be good students. We must do our work. We must study our daily lessons. We should take part in all class activities. Good children will help their friends. They will share what they have with others. They will be obedient and well behaved. Such students are called ideal students. Ideal students will be an example to others. Everybody will be proud of them. They will become the leaders of the class. Wouldn't you like to be an ideal student? Don't you want to be liked by others? Don't you want to become a leader? Yes. Of course you want to. So you must develop all the qualities needed to become an idle student. Try, try and try again. You certainly can become an ideal student. Now what's written about idle student here children? It's first said that all of us should try to become good students and for that we must do our work, we must do our daily lessons and we must take part in all school activities. Good children help their friends and they share with them what they have. These children are well behaved and disciplined. They are obedient and such children are called ideal students. Ideal students are examples to others and everybody is proud of them. They become the leaders of the class and they are liked by all. All of us can become ideal students and for that we must try, try and try again. And we certainly can become an ideal student. Now we will move on with the exercises given in the book. Exercise A. Answer the following questions. Number one, who is an ideal student? Tell me children, who is an ideal student? An ideal student is one who is obedient, well behaved and hard working. So your answer will be an ideal student. An ideal student is one who is obedient, well behaved, well behaved and hard working, well behaved and hard working, okay? Repeat the answer. An ideal student is one who is obedient, well behaved and hard working. How can you be an ideal student? How can you be an ideal student? By developing all the qualities needed to become an ideal student.
क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री हु कैन बिकम अ गुड लीडर एन आइडियल स्टूडेंट कैन बिकम अ गुड लीडर एन आइडियल स्टूडेंट कैन बिकम अ गुड लीडर बिकम अ गुड लीडर नंबर बी राइट ट्रू और फॉल्स नेक्स्ट टू इच नंबर वन ऑल स्टूडेंट्स आर आइडल स्टूडेंट्स नो ऑल स्टूडेंट्स आर नॉट आइडल स्टूडेंट्स बट ऑल मस्ट ट्राई टू बिकम आइडल स्टूडेंट्स सो दिस स्टेटमेंट इज फॉल्स नंबर टू एवरीबॉडी लाइक्स टू बी एन आइडियल स्टूडेंट यस एवरीबॉडी वॉन्ट्स टू बिकम एन आइडियल स्टूडेंट सो दिस स्टेटमेंट इज ट्रू नंबर थ्री इफ आई ट्राई आई कैन बिकम एन आइडियल स्टूडेंट येस यू कैन ऑलवेज बिकम एन आइडियल स्टूडेंट सो दिस स्टेटमेंट इज ट्रू नंबर फोर ओनली रिच स्टूडेंट्स कैन बिकम आइडियल स्टूडेंट्स नो यू डोंट नीड टू बी रिच टू बिकम एन आइडियल स्टूडेंट so this statement is false number 5 those who study well are ideal students yes ideal students are also good in studies so this statement is true number 6 ideal students are very proud no they are not proud but they are very helpful so this statement is false so once again we'll revise this number 1 all students are ideal students no all students are not ideal students so this answer is false number 2 everybody likes to be an ideal student true number 3 if i try i can become an ideal student your answer is true number 4 only rich students can become ideal students answer is false number 5 those who study well are ideal students true number 6 ideal students are very proud false moving on to the third exercise exercise c write down five qualities needed to become an ideal student here you have to write five qualities of an ideal student you will write must study his daily lessons must study his daily lessons next you will write should take part in all class activity should take part should take part in all class activities in all class activities number 3 you will write should be obedient and hard working should be obedient should be obedient and hard working and hard working next number 4 you will write he should be well behaved he should be well behaved and number 5 he should help his friends he should help his friends so children what are the five qualities needed for becoming an ideal student it is must study his daily lessons should take part in all class activities should be obedient and hard working he should be well behaved he should help his friends exercise d cut out and paste four pic 
pictures of activities which an idle student should do. Here you have to cut out and paste four pictures of activities which you think an ideal student should do. Parents, worksheet related to this topic will be uploaded on the school website. Kindly visit the school website and help your ward to do it. Also, help your ward to do all the exercises given in the book. Thank you.